Hispanics, aka Seth. Now this thing is... This is the third part of the Red Wrangler gang. Third oh. part. Third trio of this gang. This is a 1997 Jeep TJ. And this thing is not much of a TJ anymore, but it has some bits on it that are most closely related. And it's red. And it's red. And, and it says Wrangler. Wrangler. And it's a gang. Gang! <laughs> gang! This is fucking terrible. Alright. Anyway, <laughs> it's a TJ. Okay, well, uh, let's start from the front. There's a lot of shit on this thing shit ton of stuff on this thing this i know this so real quick we need to point out i know some of this vehicle seth owns this vehicle which he did not build because he is bought not built and um it's easier <laughs> <laughs> so i'm gonna say things and he'll correct me this is a worn m8000 which was cut down to scotch it was cut down to comp, comp size so it's a comp winch now so now it's worth double pretty cool feature of that sure. how, how long is this cable uh 80 feet Holy shit. Feet. Not very just long. a scotch. That's not bad. That's not bad. When you run out, it's bad. Um, she's rocking. Are you 39s? I feel like I've transported these. They are 39s. 39 inch. Uh, VF Rich crawlers. Um, the, the worse they look, the better they are. Correct. Seems like in this world. Um, it has air bomb two o air bomb two and a half inch foxes. Two and a half inch resi foxes. The where's the resi at? That was in someplace sexy. I already have it on right camera. Here. Fox. Oh yeah, deep <clears> there. Hiding. Pretty dope. That's cool. Got ourselves some, you know, cheap Chinese lights that uh, Seth probably stole from a company. We aren't going to label that company, but he stole them. Um, up from here, connecting all this together, is a 2004 Super Duty Dana 60 high pinion. It wasn't a Super 60 to begin with. However, it's a Yukon axle shafts, 35 spline outers. Uh, Yukon Super Joints. Yukon Super Joints and dry flanges. Correct. It is, and it has 35 spline outers. 35 spline outers now. With a spool on the front. Those look like stock knuckles that have bits glued to them. Uh, they're they're, they're stock knuckles that have things glued to them. Good they're to talk about that. Bolted. Sure. Um, much heim steering. Bah. Whatever. PSC. PSC. This is assist still, isn't it? It is still assist. Not full hydro. It does have a assist. The box right here is like been relocated in front. That, that's a, whose box is that? It's a one-off box. It's actually like a, if I remember correctly from the build thread, it was TJ box, maybe a Wagoneer box. No, it's a TJ box with Wagoneer internals. So rocking the, a cooler. The the worm gear the worm gears inside of it are uh, allow you to turn a little bit faster with less turns. And I got a dog leash. It's still hydro assist. It has, you know, power steering cooler. Goal is to go full <coughs> hydro this winter. Relocate the winch back here behind the grill, and so it'll be a suck down and push the front end about. There's your box for the fucking winch too. Yeah, I'm behind the headlight. Yeah, but it what is headlights? Actually, uh, yeah. Well, I mean, that where there used to be a headlight. No, this is called, <laughs> these are called speed holes now. <laughs> yes, 100% speed holes. Um, also, has, while we're in the front, it has a uh, two and a half liter or four cylinder. There goes the drone. We don't pay for those things. So that's a 5.3. Uh, we just talked about this. It's stock as could be. So, uh, yeah. I mean, <coughs> what's wrong with that? One? It's still a V8. It's still probably makes close to 250 horsepower. Sure. You know. I mean, by the time it gets to the tire, it's about 150. But it's like you know. a 07 L33 aluminum block, aluminum head, flipped intake. Aluminum so. head? Yeah. Aluminum block, aluminum head. Where's your juice A little better at the. Uh, Where's your juice I'm a Jeep. I, I need to check it. This is not aluminum. This is an iron. Come on. So it's. A little better pictures of the you think this is coilovers. It's 100% aluminum head, aluminum. Do you have something magnetic? I swear to God. There's PSC like reservoir, and these guys are okay. being complete fucking idiots. <clears throat> yep. It's like Jonathan said, <laughs> two and a half inch <laughs> resi foxes, uh, pack racing springs, upper and lower. You know, like I said, I did not build this thing. I just know the specs about it for the most part. Control it arms? Very wise uh, control arms are, uh, I believe, 250 wall. Inch and a half, pretty big, pretty, pretty beefy. Running all Heim, three link front uh, with the track bar still, pan hard coming off the frame. Uh, I'm gonna keep that as long as I can. 
because it actually works very, very well. It flexes, it jumps, it, <clears throat> it does 100 miles an hour. Uh, I got some rigid rock lights hanging out in there. This Jeep, though, recently installed. Big thing about this Jeep, it's not trail rated. It so is you, not trail rated. You cannot take this on many trails. It is I not to say, meant to go on trails at all. Mainly for malls. It's malls missing. in the driveway, and it goes in the garage occasionally. It well, usually lives in the garage. It usually lives in the garage, but it comes outside every uh, now Occasionally, this trailer sits on. Looks in great yeah, well. Just to look cool. It just likes to sit on the trailer yeah. just to look pretty. You may have seen that trailer in the past. I have my Jeep on it. Because <laughs> he's a dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait, also, the part of the frame here, the frame ends here, that's that's the end of the TJ frame, right there. Big ass lemon strap from Asfab. What's it called? <laughs> Asfab's asphalt. <laughs> um, ends there and then all turns the tube and you can see how that's all incorporated for the reservoir. Um, a big old crossover for the coilovers, like what's supported here. And this all ties to the roll cage, the rear coilover mount, all that badass stuff too, so. Mm -hmm. Inside, inside we got all the, you know, the command center. We got seat belts built done by me, so they're really good. True story. We got uh, these cool four wheel part seats, the PRP, sorry, four wheel parts harnesses, PRP, PRP seats. seats. And these things are super comfortable, fantastic. These... Quick disconnect steering wheel yep. by Joe's Racing. Joe's Racing. Wait, is that your wheel, Matt? You may have seen it. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Matt's wheel, uh, except it doesn't have He has a it. really much better quick disconnect than mine is. I'm working on that. Uh, just the normal gauges, water, oh, yeah. oil, switches. bolts. He's got switches. switches for all the things. They're not labeled correctly anymore because I've since switched out. They're down in Spanish. The... <laughs> Spanish. Uh, we don't have a pumper and we don't have, you know, all the other crap. We got rock lights now and so we use those switches for all that stuff. But two-speed Atlas, pretty generic, um, front and rear dig. Well, generic. I wouldn't really associate Atlas with generic, but yeah. Generic Atlas, we'll call it that. You can see it, right? You know, if you take off this 600 pound fucking plate under here. That, that, that Billy Pan is super heavy. It's a tombstone, I call it. Tombstone. It's really big, really heavy, really obnoxiously big, and yes. really obnoxiously heavy. But this Jeep has seen more than just a few malls. It's seen some hard malls. Yeah, I've seen a lot of hard and malls. And as you can tell by all this side plating and everything, which is, this all is gem. And, and all this too. Like, look yeah. at all that. Like, there you go. I don't like paint, so like, When you're take, partying on the side, you do off. like paint. I, yeah, I somebody got to me that you want to get these doors painted. Shut up. Look at this. You just say <laughs> sweet That's the gas cap. Oh, you know why this is like that? Because I'm an idiot and I left my gas cap back here my last wheel and trip and it fell off in the uh, Never Neverland. So, so that's my current gas cap situation. What's that gas tank you got in there? Uh, I don't know. Aerotech Labs. It's in Ramsey, New Jersey, US, ATL. Fuel cell. Fuel cell. Uh, has a bunch of baffles in it. Holds about 20 gallons worth of fuel. The, the foam in there to like absorb the fuel? It does not have foam. Oh, really? No, they're just little round Relocation baffles. for the radiator. Yeah. It's These are actually two-speed Volvo fans, believe it <laughs> or not. If you read the relay, you can tell that. And it says Volvo relay cooling fan two-speed. Because you know what the Swedish people are? They are cool. And that's a custom Griffin oh, radiator and, you know, radiator shroud. It uh, actually has to come out because it has it's leaking on that tank and that tank right now. So that's going to come out. You soon. know what we missed that was important? All the sexiness in this corner and that corner too. Because there's bypasses. Hold on, we're getting there. <laughs> so you got 2.0 Fox Resis with pack racing springs. And then you got these beautiful guys. Some, some bypasses. Quadruple bypasses, fantastic. Don't feel nothing at all. Anything, ever. Anything, ever. It's just soft, it's like, it's like a pillow. You know what you have when you have bypasses? You don't have any feel for guilt. True story. But we skipped over, you know, the other thing that powers this, which is? 10 and a half inch. Yeah, 10 and a half sterling. Uh, Yukon zip locker, 538 gears. It needs a shave kit though. It does need a shave kit because it's a boat anchor for sure. So the shave kit basically goes like right here and just whoop, laps that whole piece off. And then you weld the plate up in there, takes off a shit ton of fucking ground clearance. Like three inches again for that? Something like that. More asphalt straps in the back. Uh, four link in the back? Four link in the rear. One, two. String there, right? Three, no four. Yep. No track bar. Track also has bump stops, no track bar. Still tubed in the back as well. You can see frame ends there. Tubed from there. Um, bead for locks. For anti rock. Bead locks. Ocean handle from a razor, looks like. Uh, what else are we missing? Um, everything is AN. 
there is not a single like eh, I shouldn't say a single there's a few hose clamps here and there but everything's all in fitting from the radiator fuel everything's all in so i do love that on the radio that is aim that's like a that's a girthy a, sexy yeah that's thing. a massive a in fitting right there i don't even know what size i don't speak a in fitting very well i don't either but it's big I, and looks good i speak english good english bad english some spanish mostly spanish mostly spanish <laughs> <laughs> all right so that's the review yeah. on the yeah that's the this is a tj tj 99 bucket. 97 right 97 97 mostly stock couple mods pretty dope though yeah, pretty dope. It's only been wheeled once or twice, maybe. And if you want to see more badass things, buy apparel so you can also sponsor somebody like this. I need a phone. I have a phone. <laughs>